Hello guys, in today's video we are making some baked oats. I absolutely loved baked oats, they're the perfect breakfast, perfect snack, perfect for anything. All of these recipes are healthy, they're plant-based, and they're super quick and easy. I post a lot of these on TikTok, so I thought I would bring them to YouTube. We're making three different types of baked oats, I'm gonna walk you through it step by step, so let's get right into it. We are starting out with some chocolate banana baked oats. This was one of the first baked oats recipes I ever made. It went viral on TikTok. You guys are going to love this. Start off by mashing half a banana in an oven safe container. You can also add all of these ingredients to a blender and blend them up if you'd like. If you don't want to use banana, you can use an egg if you're not plant based. You can use a flax egg, some applesauce. Don't be afraid to experiment with things. Add a half a cup of oats. I blend my oats. I'll show you how to do that at the end of the video. Add two tablespoons of cacao powder, a tablespoon of maple syrup, a teaspoon of vanilla, a little pinch of salt really brings out the flavor, a half a teaspoon of baking powder, and some oat milk. You can use any dairy-free milk you'd like. Mix it all together. I'm using five banana slices on the top. I think it makes it really cute. Adding some mini chocolate chips. And we're gonna bake at 350 for about 15 to 17 minutes, depending on the texture you like. These are the perfect beginner baked oats. If you're trying to get into making baked oats, I definitely recommend trying this recipe out. It's definitely a crowd favorite. Next up, we have some peanut butter and jelly baked oats. These taste amazing. You are gonna love these. We're gonna start out by microwaving a few frozen raspberries. This is gonna help us make our jam. If you don't have frozen raspberries, you can just use jam. You can use any berry you want. Really, just make it your own. Then in an oven safe container, mash half of a banana. You can also make a double batch if you want, just double all of the ingredients. Sometimes I like to do that if I'm sharing. Add your oats. Once again, I'm using blended oats, some maple syrup, vanilla, baking powder. You can use peanut butter or almond butter. I'm using almond butter. Add some oat milk. And don't forget your pinch of salt. I almost forgot my pinch of salt. Then we're gonna add our homemade jam, or if you're using regular jam, cover that up with your oats. We are gonna add a little bit of almond butter on top and some of the extra jam. Swirl that around and we're gonna bake at 350 for 15 to 17 minutes. And you are ready to enjoy your PB&J baked oats. These are definitely a little bit different. They have some different textures, some different flavors, salty and sweet mixed up. You are going to love it. This last recipe is probably my favorite and it's super easy to make. We're going to mash half of a banana in an oven safe container. Add your oats, maple syrup, vanilla, pinch of salt, some oat milk, and baking powder. Mix that all together, add in a handful of chocolate chips, and mix those into the batter. And then we're going to top it with some extra chocolate chips so it looks just like a cookie, and bake at 350 for 15 to 17 minutes once again. And you have some cookie dough baked oats. Kids love these, you're going to love them. You can have cookie dough for breakfast. I'm going to show you how I make my oat flour. You can buy oat flour or you can just use regular rolled oats, but this is what I do to all of my oats for my baked oats. I start out with some gluten-free old-fashioned rolled oats and I add them to a blender. Blend them up until you get this super fine powder and this is what I use in all of the oats. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video, three different baked oats. You guys have to try them out. Send me pictures, tag me on Instagram. Let me know what you think and what other videos you want me to do. If you guys like the video, definitely leave it a like, subscribe to see more from me. I will link all my socials down below. You can see a ton of content from me on places like Instagram, TikTok, all of that. I hope to see you guys in the next one. I'm sending you all of my good energy and peace out.